this is Boots, Bats and Balls. I'm Rich Hughes. Uh, I'm here uh, with Jamie, Dave and Jack. Um, and we're here till, hang on, what time will it be? 12 o'clock. Okay. Uh, now, we've got a young lad in. His name's Jack. And I believe he does Speedway. Yeah, that's right. Yeah? Yeah. Right, well, let's have a chat about that. That's what I say. Let's do some Speedway chat. Take it away, Dave. So, if anyone doesn't know, Jack rides for Birmingham in the National League in Speedway. Um, so, what I kind of want to know is, Jack, how did you get into Speedway in the first place? How was that? How did well, that come uh, out? Basically, from when I was born, all I've known is Speedway, really, with my dad being a professional Speedway rider for 27 years. Was right. he was he was he a big influence in yeah he you de- joining yeah him? he was he was a massive influence like winning like three three British titles and uh, being in a, being a Grand Prix rider and riding in all different countries it's always been like a, a dream of mine to follow his steps really. So this season you've been riding for Birmingham. You signed for well you did a few meetings last season um, and you signed properly for them this season. Talk to us about how it's been going. Um, have you won many meetings? How's it? How's the season been going for you? Yeah. Uh, we uh, started the season off against Stoke at home. Uh, we won that meeting. It was a it was it was a good meeting. Stoke put up a good fight, but uh, yeah, we're tipped to win the league this year. So uh, we're hoping to like win most of our meetings. We can. Uh, we've uh, done Buxton home and away. I got a ride the night at home against Buxton. I didn't have a really uh, as good one at Buxton. It was my first time there. Uh, tricky track to ride, really. Uh, and then yeah, tonight we've got uh, we've got Stoke at at Stoke. So. Uh, if you're around, come on down. It should be a good night of racing. So yeah, something um, that happened at Buxton. I, I believe you got a pretty bad injury. I saw. I saw online what happened there. Yeah, uh, in one of my last races, uh, I took a, a quite a big fall. Uh, I made the start. We're going into the corner, and uh, I got t-boned and coming out the corner. And yeah, I picked up an injury, but I feel I feel good for tonight to to put in a good performance. Also this season you've been doing some under 21 things, you're also in the uh, under 21 British final, how did that go, was that a good experience for you? Yeah it was good, uh, I was. I had to go into the British under 21 semi-final first to, to qualify for the final, uh, I wasn't in the actual semi-final at first, someone uh, pulled out with a broken wrist so I got the chance to get in and uh, it was a tough night, I made it harder than I should have done but I got there in the end and I got through on uh, 7 points, finished ninth in the top you needed to get in the top 10 to make it through to the final at Sheffield and uh yeah I, I at the under 21 final I put in a put in a good a good effort against like world class riders and stuff so I en- I enjoyed the learning the learning curve so yeah um also this season you're also um a reserve for the world under 21 semi at Bellevue which is in a couple of weeks um are you looking forward to that? Surely that's something massive for you. Yeah, it is. Like uh, for not even being in the under twenty one semi to to qualify for my own under twenty one final, my own national uh, uh, meet, and uh, to 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 get to get into the under twenty one semi, then get into the final, and then uh, get picked at, at reserve for the world under twenty one. It's it's definitely been a a good couple of weeks for me. Yeah, so. hope, hopefully you'll be able to get on and. Um, have some races yeah, in that if anyone falls off or fingers crossed for a ride yeah um, so in terms of uh, senior speedway the world grand prix series starts on april 30th if uh, people are interested in that it's sort of like the world championship uh, it's the highest level of speedway uh, it starts in slovenia on april 30th who do you think is going to win who are you tipping to win this year do you think ty will uh, do it again yeah I, th- I think ty will get his uh, third one to be fair but uh, it would be nice to see uh, greg with his age as well, t- to to win another one before yeah. he retires, it would be nice to see that. But yeah, my money's on Ty to get a third one. To be fair, yeah. If anyone doesn't know, Ty Woffenden, probably the biggest British rider at the moment, uh, reigning champion in the World Championship as well. Is Grand Prix riding something you want to look to do in the future? Do you think? Do you think you'll be able to make it to that level? Hopefully. Yeah, I, I like to think it's, it's most mostly every rider's goal to get to the top. Like. Like every footballer's dream to be the best footballer, really. Uh, uh, it's definitely a dream of mine to get there. A lot of hard work and effort, obviously, to do it. Uh, yeah, just I'll put in the effort and see see what the future brings. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully we'll be able to see you on the on the world stage soon. Um, but yeah, Jack will be riding in. Well, tonight's meeting at Stoke. Birmingham are playing away at Stoke. So if you want to get yourselves down there, it's a seven o'clock start. 
um, at Stoke Stadium in Chesterton. So if you want to get yourselves down there, remember 7 o'clock and you'll be able to see some great speedway with riders like Jack. There you go. Bit of speedway. Uh, we're on reports Jack coming on the show. That's amazing, isn't it? Lovely, lovely, lovely. 